Yes, Impact Arena with the wonderfully manicured lawns and shrubbery. In we go. And we can tell you that uh, Lee So Hee and Shin, Shun Chan of Korea as the third seeds of down Polly and Loheyu, last week's women's doubles champion, 21, 16, 21, 18 in uh, 57 minutes. And, well, next up, the daddies, triple world champions, Asan and Setiawan. How will they go? The second seeds against Li Yang and Wang Chi Lin. This one, a real semi-final that promises so much. A, a mouth-watering all-seeded men's doubles, quite frankly. And the conjurous reigning triple world champions of Asan and Setiawan. That's how the draw looks. And up above, Ranki Reddy and Shetty take on Chia and So of Malaysia. So, uh, so much excitement today around the men's doubles event, isn't there? So first up, it'll be the one highlighted at the bottom of the draw. Li Yang and Wan Chi Lin against Asan and Setiwan, the sixth and the second seeds going toe to toe Please out here. Well, the champions of last week in the Yonex Thailand Open, here they come, led out by Wang Chi Lin and the partner that he's known since they were very young kids in school, Lee Yang. And these two men of vast experience. Mohamed Hassan and Hendra Setiawan with those otherworldly skills he has in seeing the shuttle so early. 6-2 these two lead head-to-head -head. they've won the last three matches against the men from Chinese Taipei but Wang and Li much improved they've added to their armory they're stronger their defense is more robust they're slightly more skillful according to them should be a belter black red black red black Seven receiver. Receive. Hassan Seb. So Mohammed Hassan wanting to serve. And we'll have a change of ends. Masks off. Action <coughs> to begin. Steen, your thoughts quickly coming into this? Uh, the um, the Indonesians um, have the upper hand head to head, but the last two encounters in almost a year back they were close. They were 21-19 in the cider. Um, Hassan is nursing um, a calf injury, left calf. You can't see it because he's wearing these um, compression uh, trousers, black compression trousers, but. Um, left calf is um, strapped and, uh, I mean he's not as mobile as um, as before but we've seen them win the whole England where a son was not uh, where Setuan was not uh, really mobile one and a half leg in my opinion still won the all England so they could still do it and uh, that's gonna be interesting but um, a little um, extra um, small small gift to uh, the Yang and Wang Chilin can they exploit it That's their route through. And as you can see, it was the Germans that they downed in the quarterfinal there, Lamswiss and Seidel. And well, they've not been detained for any longer than 32 minutes. Just a mark of the confidence that they've taken from last week's title. But also really a, a, a route to the semifinal that you dream of. <laughs> yes, well said. These two, 33 years of age. What else is there to say about the second seeds? They've pretty much done it all, haven't they? Unable to defend their All England title of 2019. They lost out in the quarterfinals the following year, but uh, three times world and reigning world champions. Quite a coup. And there's their 
route through as well, taking down a couple of English pairs, much improved uh, Lane and Vendy, but again, you know, pretty straightforward. Detained the longest with uh, Ellison Langridge, that was a 47 minute affair. Other than that though, a couple of 30 minute matches, they are just something else, aren't they? Almost born for badminton, set you one. Service judge just opposite. And yeah, what's so extraordinary about their three world championship titles, Asan and uh, Setuan, is that they've actually never lost a match in the world championships. Every time they've been entered together, they won. So, um, Of course, one more title with uh, Marcus Kido back in um, 2007. Ladies and gentlemen, on my right, Mohammad Ahsan and Andra Satyawan, Indonesia. And on my left, Li Yang and Wang Chili, Chinese Taipei. Hey! Mohammad Ahsan served to Wang Chili, love of Li. <laughs> Seven over. One love. Seven over. One all. Seven is over. Two, one. Seven is over. Two, all. Locking that court from uh, Mother Sun. Three, two. It was uh, Asan and Setuan who chose ends. They chose, of course, to start on, uh, as you can see, the far side of the court. The attack back's a little bit extra because they're playing with the drift. Well, I say they've won the last Four, three, these two, two, and they have indeed, but the last two have been taking the distance, 21-19 in the third game in both of the last two matches, so it's always been pretty tight. Oh. It was in the Indonesian Seven Masters, goal. their last showing, and the three, Malaysian Masters four. as well of 2020. Proud of that with the World Tour Finals 2019. But they are familiar foes, these two. But uh, these two in your picture, in white, much improved. Oh, wow, that's what we're talking about. Just otherworldly. <laughs> he sees that so quickly on the... Cross block Three. off the backhand was just, well, unreal. And he does it with that sort of sense of calm, doesn't he? Yeah. The silent assassin. <laughs> yes, quite. <laughs> Because of his skills uh, yeah. at the net and his uh, very, very calm demeanor. Yeah, and, uh, like a monk, in. isn't he? It's almost Six. meditative in the way Three. that he plays. He's like that off-board as well, just a, a calm demeanor entirely. Looks like he doesn't get 
excited about too much. Seven, three. One of the problems for Li and, and Wang playing Asan and Sichuan is that Li Yang, who is uh, the preferred front court player from um, the Chinese Taipei pair, is um, meeting his match and more so uh, here when he's playing Asan and Sichuan. No matter whom Seven the Indonesians goal. is playing Four, the front court, Seven. they will also they will always be uh, be able to match him. And, um, makes it difficult for him to dominate as um, he would like to and set up his partner Wang Chilin who's got a really lethal smash tall man oh! brilliant well played and just on cue there was that powerful Five, smash seven. That as well. Seven Eight, five. No sense of panic here. That's so little time. But look, takes his time. Four shots played in the tram lines. Yeah. <laughs> That's a narrow court. What? Seven, Six, it's the movement eight. to his left side that is a little bit um, of a Four. problem for uh, Mohamed Hassan. That's where he needs to break on his um, left leg. Masterful again from Mohamed Hassan there. That was Seven, just Nine, spellbinding Six. return quality. Fortunately put away. If they can get oh. Setuan to move goal. from side Seven. to side on the backcourt, then uh, they have a, a good chance. Rifled down, wasn't it? Arrow like in its flight well, path. It's been called out. Oh. Oh. I think he's got a good point here. Steve? <laughs> yeah, I'm uh, refraining. <laughs> First challenge of the match. Oh. Challenge unsuccessful. One challenge remaining. Eight, nine. Play. Loose shot Ten from Lee Yang. Ten, eight. And Dosetion was licking his lips when he oh. saw that he was going to fire on that one. Seven, nine, ten. Right behind the back save there from Li Yang, but to no avail in the end. It's uh, Asan and Setiwan that uh, edge to the interval with a two point lead, 11 points to nine.
stress Jangan dilayani. Sekali kalau posisi kamu lagi di atas enggak apa sekali. Kalau enggak dipindahin ke geser gini, kalau enggak direm. Udah itu aja. Di depannya selalu habis naro apa apa, dia pasti baliknya setengah jarangan ya. Setengahnya mesti dijaga itu. Hah? Ya. Terus Nah, nah, ini oh, nggak enak panjangin dulu, penting datar. Kalau nggak digeser pressing silam, ya, oke, di fotoknya dia kamu, oke, okay, He also has the Italian gestures, uh, Harry Piangari, the Indonesian coach. Lots of um, arm work in the explanation. Eleven, nine, Ali. Well right from Wang Chi Lin. 10, 11. Excellent placement. The smash from uh, Hendra Sichuan. Five world ranking spots between these two teams. Li and Wang at seven in the world. That's an set you on two. But confidence from these two in white and green, having won the title last week, should uh, serve them well. But at the moment, it's the world number twos with a three point lead. <laughs> no! David Gogan, 11 13. A couple of nice points, nice quick points for Li and Wang. Second goal, 14, 12. Such intensity from Mohammed Hassan. Yeah, and again, smashing towards the middle. In between the two players, trying to activate his uh, partner at the net. Well, I tell you who's under-activated is Wang Chilin. We've not seen much of... Uh, they're not lifting away much to him, that's for no. sure. It's been spoken about. Nice, straight smash, laser-like down the line. And now we mentioned the um, leg injury to uh, Muhammad Hassan, but I have to say that um, he's playing and moving better than I expected him to. So, luckily for the Indonesians and for the tournament, it seems like uh, he's had some good treatment. 16, 12. During the last couple of days. Yeah, it's all out attack, isn't it, from the yellow and blue team? Really enjoying the faster end, getting on the front foot and not letting up. David Thorpe. And not an ease and almost a majesty about the way that they ply their trade. Hassan and Setiawan. Well, Seven Li Yang, four. they're just trying Seven so eight. hard to rush Thank the Indonesians, but really struggling at the moment. Checking if the umpire was ready. Leon, can you just call out? Well, he thinks he's found this one, does uh, 
Li Yang? Yeah, I'll, I'll risk it and say that it was long. Asan and Setiawan were quite surprised, and there's a wince in his eye as if to say, maybe not. Yeah, you're right, quite a way. Challenge unsuccessful, one challenge remaining. Eighteen, thirteen. Play. That's well played. You can see Seven when, when the Yang is successful 18. in uh, securing the attack for Wang Chilin, then um, they have a chance. Thank you. Last week's winners, but. Um, most of the rallies have been played on Asan and Sechuan's terms, and that's what they're so good at. Seventh over, nineteen fourteen. Twenty game point fourteen. Six game points then for the second seeds. Game Excellent. Ah. Well that was a really Ten dictatorial, game no Asan nonsense Asan game Asan from Asan and Setiawan. They take the opening game. Twenty one points to fourteen. Only quarter of an hour needed. of four in the world with his partner a while ago, Wang Chunli. Well, uh, he'd be able to Second give game. them any pearls of advice. He was very talkative Love all. on the change events. And there was a concerned Play. look uh, yes. on the faces of yeah. um, the two players from Chinese Taipei. And they looked a little down, didn't they? Oh. Understandably. But now they've got the faster end Stay and they go. get on the attack Long. early. Long. Uh, I wouldn't be surprised if... Um, if they won this second game and force a decider, but at the moment I think uh, Asan Sechuan big favourites to um, go through to the final. David Thomas, one on. Seven's over. Two, one. Seven's over. Two, on.
That's nice. Nice way to redeem the Ten service dollar. error. Three. It's a very good Two. service return. I might be mistaken, but I, I think I remember having seen Sitio and Chase those Four. earlier on. There's a fault. Four. Five. Two. Both players touch the shuttle. Three, Powering through four. from the tougher of the two ends. Three. Standing smash from Sichuan. This is what Asan and Sichuan are looking to do here four. in the second oh. game. They're, they're looking to win the service situation, get the easy points. Uh, play control defense, I think, and then uh, counter attack. I don't think we're going to see them try and attack as much as we saw in, in the first game, unless they have very, very short lifts. Well, that was a good counter attack, almost. I thought he'd found that Seven one, four. but not quite. Five, four. Six, four. Super tight serve from Wang Chilin. Suddenly he's already starting to feature a little bit more in game two here. Oh, oh. that's fantastic play. Seven, four. Saw a lot of this, didn't we, in, in their maiden super yeah. thousand level victory, taking the title last week. Yeah. He was very dominant, very big on court. But that really there looked like he'd been hypnotized to believe he was Sukumulio at the net. Oi. Oh, wow. Don't see that too often. Look at that. Five, <laughs> seven. To throw the racket over. Yeah, I get it. Well, he must have given this one the treatment. Right at the top of the string bed, where there's perhaps no cross string to reinforce Really unlucky for him. Yeah. Lee and Wang. It's a good opportunity, Luke, from where he played that um, <laughs> shot. Almost mid court what? area. Lee. <laughs> Clever little flick Lee. serve Seven. from Satyawan. They're picking up so many easy points at the Seven. moment. Oh. Asan and Sichuan. Indonesians they, uh, lost last week. They lost to Chosul Ju and um, Susan J. Susan J. Who we're going to watch later today in um, mixed doubles discipline. It seems like um, the Koreans they have a really good grip on um, at least um, some of the Indonesian pairs. Really solid in defense and uh, Seven moves fast. Eight. Not oh. afraid to play the flat game. So we can extend the rallies beyond. Um, What's comfortable for Asan and Sichuan. But they're out of the tournament. Oh. Hey! David Dolman. Nine. Eight. Woo. The match being played you feel on their terms yeah so good at doing that aren't they there's not the they energy are. about the men from Chinese Taipei that we saw our all of last week uh, they're yeah. muffled and stifled somehow no I, I don't totally agree because I, I just don't think they, they're being Nine. let, let oh. um, 
into the match. Yeah. It, it, it's like you said earlier on, Asan and Sechi, when they're so good at imposing their style on their opponents, and, and if you don't if you don't lift, and we know that, if, oh. that's why I mentioned the Koreans, they, they're not afraid to lift. They just lift, and then they play for there the defense, and they have a plan in no. defense, or they perhaps have a more advanced plan in the defense than most other pairings, how to work themselves out of it and how to exploit the defense. Four. So um, that's well spotted, it was 11, a double hit. Nine. Into the wall. So they're more of a threat to the Indonesians, the Koreans, and um, they must have been delighted when they saw they left the tournament. So to the turn then, a change of look. Lee and Wang, 11-9, in the lead, game two. Well, I wonder how Harry's feeling about the sort of performances of Alfian and Arianto. They really have underperformed, haven't they, in the last couple of weeks? Maybe they can shine Eleven, next week in the nine. flagship event. Uh, Alfian and Arianto can't because they uh, missed out oh, of course. since um, they uh, lost to Lane and Wendy here. So uh, I totally agree. They haven't really been impressive in these two tournaments. It's, it's mostly been Gracia and um, and Rahaya who has sort of uh, been flying the Indonesian flag Hi. together with um, in the first tournament, probably Jordan and Octaviante. And so Carnando and Martin as well, the, the, the boys doubled. Yeah, they, they reached a good semi final in the yeah. first tournament. Um, so had a couple of good results, but overall, I think um, the Indonesians would say that, um, okay, let's focus on week three. Um, Men's singles have um, not been convincing Ten. either and so well. on, but I think we've seen a lot of players here where they, they've had to come to terms with um, getting back to tournament play and also um, staying in the, the quarantine bubble, being confined to um, the hotel rooms and so on. So. Um, we're going to see uh, a lot of players' pairs improve um, if badminton continues to uh, be staked in the months Ten. to come. Ten. Well, they've won five out of the last six, 14, Lee 10. and Wang, and that will really help their cause. Enjoying the faster end, a little bit more purchase on everything they do. And definitely got the momentum with them. Fifteen. Good luck 10. as well. Never goes amiss. And you called it, Steen. It does look like uh, they're really enjoying their time at the far end, these two. Superb serve and follow up from Wang. Ten. David Dover, 11, 16. David Dover, 17, 11. David Dover, 12. 
13, 17. It looks like a comfortable lead for Li and uh, Wang, but they really got to be careful because two quick points for Asan and Secho and then they're within striking distance and you can easily get a little bit uh, nervy. He read it so fast, Hendra Sechuan, from the racket and body position of uh, Wang Chilin. Saw that um, there was a good chance of a cross. And a couple of unforced errors from Lin Yang. And uh, they'll be getting a little bit tense, as you're implying, Steen. The Indonesians nibbling away at their lead. And how many how many shots have they played? Ten 16, altogether. 17. Three points for Hassan and Sichuan. Yeah, I'd say. Yeah, it's been very efficient. Thank you. A real lapse from the men from Chinese Taipei. So five in a row for Hassan and Sichuan. Keen to get this Lee. done in straight games. Second oh. over, eighteen, sixteen. Oh. Found it. Brilliant from Hassan. Laser like around the front court. Seven seventeen, eighteen. Eighteen. Oh. It's hard to believe that just moments ago they were. 17 11 down. Hey. Extremely good hey. shot. Let's go. 19 hey. 18. Hey. Bad decision from uh, Li Yang. Want to complete? Twenty game points nineteen. Well, can they detain the second seeds? That's and set you on game point for Lee and Wang. Well, Wang Chilin furious with himself there. Twenty oh.
second, second very goal. good return towards 21. the forehand side 20. of uh, Hendra Sechuan. So a second game point opportunity for the men from Chinese Taipei. Can they extend their stay this weekend? No! Yes, they can. They delight in securing game, game two. Leon and really one, tight two, game. 33 20, minutes of play have long. unfolded. And Li Yang and Wan Chi Lin are okay for a little bit longer. 22 20, they take game two. So, all four players Final back game. for this one game shootout then. Who's it going to be? For a spot Play. in tomorrow's men's doubles title decider. No! One, lock. Excellent third shot from uh, Li Yang. Two, low. That's fantastic awareness by Hendra Sechuan. There's a really nice two. interception as well from Mohamed Hassan, but I mean, I don't think I can describe what kind of touch it takes to play that shot in such a fast paced game. Just sensed immediately, didn't he, Steen? Well worded that they were backpedaling. Yeah. Great awareness. Standing way too far back, uh, Li and Wang at the moment. The Indonesians are going to come out and, and try and play exactly the same as the first game and um, attack. They know they're playing with the drift and they're going to be you. more relentless in their attack now than they were in the second game. So they really need to push their stance forward, Lee and uh, Wang, to be able to have options enough from the defense. That's a fantastic service return. Oi, what a rally. One, two, three. Three. What about that? Two. Save from uh, Asan and then the kill from the net afterwards. Ah. Thank you. Thank you. Oh. I 
the show all over again. It, it's like it's, it's it's a surprise to Li and Wang what what the Indonesians are, are trying to do. They should have spotted that by now. That uh, it's all about getting the initiative, and if you don't have the initiative, then the Indonesians are going to play at your front court. <laughs> Three, four. Turn the back line with that. Mixes it up so well, Five, doesn't he, Hendricetti, when you do not know what's coming next. So versatile. No! David Thorne. Five on. Set you in with the service error. First of the year, probably. <laughs> Break off the net. I'm set to one. Dolman. Six on. So tough to Five. relinquish the point once they're on the attack, anyway. Oh. Back to back net cords. Wow. <laughs> Seven. Six. It's almost like it's written in the stars, Steen. It's going to be an Indonesian day. In men's doubles, anyway. Not as far as the uh, <laughs> women are concerned. He's apologising, uh, Sechuan, but I, I don't know what he's saying. Is he saying, yeah, sorry, but you know I always do this. And, uh, Eight, six. One of the things that's special with the two Indonesians is that they're almost equally good at covering both backhand and forehand at the net. Most other players, they prefer either of those two. A lot prefers to cover the backhand, actually. But they're really good at both. Boy, that's a beauty of a defensive shot from Li Yang. Well, that'll give him confidence. Look at this. Oh, perfect touch. Audacious. Well done. Nine. And well, a really eight. good patch, Li Yang. Yeah. And his first men's double semi final really living up to its billing. And we've got more to bring you from the top half after this. Brilliant play. 
making sure that they're not hitting full power so they don't give the Indonesians enough to feed off. That's really worked well in the attack and also um, Li Yang in the defense just blocking or playing soft flat when the Indonesians attack that has really helped the uh, winners from last week. Eleven, eight. Well, how about that? Five in a row in favor of Li Yang and Wang Chilin to go to the mid-game interval in game three. That really will help their cause. They're delighted it's high fives all round. Semi-finals. There's a line judge on that um, service line, and the person was not really paying attention. Five, fourteen, nine. Five. Eight out of the last nine have gone their way. Second goal. Now, is this where the fight back begins? 14. Uh, I'd need some um, good serving from uh, Hassan. Ah! Clever service 11, to Li Yang, so he couldn't really play the long forehand of um, Hendo Setiawan. Set you and move before he hits. So, it's very early that um, they become so vocal, the uh, Chinese Taipei Ooh. pair. No! Oh. Are they playing well? 16, 11. Is it enough? Is the question on everybody's lips? Five point cushion to get against, get a win against the daddies. Yeah, and they were 17 11 up in the second game, and uh, in double quick time it was uh, square. Ah! Strength from Wang Chilin. Ah! Yeah, and, and right it's, it's Li Yang who sets it all up. Look how he moves forward there and plays a really good net shot. They're twinning nicely now, aren't they? Showing their, their uh, pedigree. The Aye. victorious team of last week. A timely break to the front. Looking very dictatorial. Oh. It's just Aye. gone as well. Aye. 18, 11. No 
that's a tough task for the Indonesians. Oh! 1911. Hey! Well, they've surged just in the nick of time, hasn't they? Lee and Wang. Two they points away now. From six, six, eight down. They took over. Match point, 11. Well, how about this? Second seeds right up against it now. Nine match points for Li Yang and Wang Chi Lin. That's a really good performance. Excellent fight back there. Same cover. 12, 20. I almost got too confident in um, the second game and could have lost it in two, but I've um, been really impressed with them here in uh, the decider. Game. And there it is. Last week's men's doubles champions find a way after a very tough Fine start. Combi against Setiawan Leon and Asan. It is Li Yang and Wang Chi Lin, the sixth seeds, who patiently orchestrate a clever win. That was a really good men's doubles semi-final to watch. Coming through, 14-21, 22-20, in 50 minutes. Delighted with that. And, uh, well, for Asan and Setiawan, a rough day at the office after a strong start, unable to contain the two athletes from Chinese Taipei. Don't go too far because we'll be bringing you the top half men's double semi final next up Rankiuredi and Shetty against Chia and So of Malaysia.
Oh, glorious sun beating down outside around the Impact Arena here in Bangkok, the Thai capital. Beautiful scenes and glorious inside as well as we uh, have completed two of our ten matches we'll be bringing you on semi-final Saturday. Women's doubles, Lee and Shin of Korea coming through against last week's champions. Not so in the men's doubles though. Lee 